Uh, hey, it's your pal Palimation. All right, and we have a couple minutes before the uh, Mr. Sakurai Presents Sephiroth uh, starts. I am dressed in Mario attire because I will say I 50% expect to see uh, Gino here. Obviously, no guarantee, but I strongly feel he's going to come back as a Mii Fighter. And if he comes back as a Mii Fighter costume, like it's, it definitely seems like it would be with uh, Sephiroth. Um, I don't expect to see anything Sora related. I'm still holding out for Sora. I think there's still a decent little chance that uh, we'll end up getting him, that he'll end up coming back. I actually have like a, a theory within a theory for Sora, and that is that um, you probably heard the theory that people are having that uh, Nintendo went to Square asking for Sora. They tried to get him, it failed, and so they ended up getting Sephiroth as a backup. Uh, my theory within a theory adds on to that and says that they failed their first try when they were going to get five characters for the second pass, but then they eventually succeeded, and that's why they're like, okay, we already have Sephiroth, so let's make Sora the sixth and final fighter since we already got five fighters. It's a theory within a theory, like definitely a <laughs> very good chance it doesn't happen, but it's just an idea that I had that I was thinking about, and... Uh, yeah, so uh, other me costumes I could definitely see happening. Uh, I don't. Well, I won't even know if I'll say see happening, but I think if they were to go with other me fighters from uh, Final Fantasy VII, I could definitely see Tifa being great for the me fighter or the me brawler, and then I could definitely see Barrett being perfect for me gunner. I mean, he has a gun for an arm, like that's as perfect as you get. I would love to see that. That'd be cool to be able to have Cloud, Tifa, Barrett, and Sephiroth all in Smash Bros. That's something I never expected would have happened in a million years. Oh, and we're starting. Cool. Ah, uh, if not Gino, I'm expecting at least one deluxe me costume. Oh, Barrett! Barrett! I, oh, and Tifa! I caught them both! Oh, I fucking was right on the money! Fuck yeah, that's awesome! Oh, that's so fucking cool! Oh my god, I was I was right on the money. Holy crap! You guys heard it here first. Legit. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> they reduced their moves. There's no way they're like. Oh, and we get Eris. Oh my gosh! I can make Sephiroth kill Eris over and over and over again. This is the dream. Or I can make Eris kill Sephiroth. All right, who? Chocobo. Ooh, I would love to see uh, Black Mage as a deluxe me costume too. Black Mage is probably my second favorite Final Fantasy character. I'd be all for it. All, all. Aw, he's he's just a normal one. Oh come on, that's that's a little disappointing. At least it definitely seems like he's coming back with the the soft the um, music. Sorry, I had to poke my screen. I had a low battery notification. Man, what a like roller coaster that was. I went from being like so damn hyped to seeing like Tifa and Barrett and Aerith, and then immediately went down to seeing Gino so, as just a basic me costume. Basic ass bitch. Alright, so I think I'm just going to upload this video as just my reaction to the Mii Fighters. I expect Sephiroth to show very cool stuff, but I don't know if it's reaction-worthy uh, stuff. Uh, overall, I'm very mixed. Uh, I feel very mixed right now. I'm excited to see all the Final Fantasy VII characters. That's amazing. I I thought that like there was a chance we'd get Tifa and Bear, but I... Well, I don't even know if I'd say there was a chance. I like thought that I was like, oh, that'd be really cool. That's totally possible. I didn't think it would happen just because I knew how hard Cloud and Sephiroth probably were to get in the first place. I wasn't expecting to see more characters. But the fact that they actually did it and got them, that's awesome. Being able to play as five different Final Fantasy VII characters and Smash Bros, that's beyond cool. Uh, but on the other hand, Geno was definitely a huge disappointment. Like, uh, it's bad in, like, I'm, I actually preferred him as a me fighter. I would have been all for him being a character. I would have been hype about it. But I think he works so well as a Mii Fighter that it would have, like, saved a slot for someone 
some other loved character to be in. So I would have been all for him as a deluxe me costume. Uh, I don't know why they didn't do it. It seemed easy. It seemed obvious. Uh, I noticed they played the Beware the Forest Mushroom song with him. I don't know if that means it's coming with him or not. I hope it does. I imagine it does. I mean, I don't think they would play it otherwise. But yeah, I'm I'm mixed opinions overall. But uh, at least Gino's speculation is it's definitely put to rest now. Like he's he's in the game. He's not going to be a fighter. Sadly, sorry for all you Gino fans out there. I was. I was, uh, like I said, I want him as a me fighter, but I was rooting for you too. Uh, Sora's still in the running. Like, he's definitely, uh, his chances are hurt pretty badly by Sephiroth, but I don't think it's impossible. I think, end of the day, Nintendo does whatever Nintendo wants to do. I don't think they pay any attention. Uh, I'm sorry for uh, camera quality. I'm doing this on my phone with very poor lighting. I try, I try my best to do better lighting, but... Uh, I don't do a lot of live footage stuff. In the future, I plan to invest in a better camera and lighting and whatnot, but most of my stuff I do is, like, animated and, uh, video game footage. But, um, yeah, thanks for, uh, checking, checking out this channel. Thanks for, uh, watching my reaction. Uh, and I just want to do one more little tidbit for, uh, all of my, all my new subscribers, everyone who just, uh, subscribed to me and is, uh, waiting to see what I do next. Um, I just want to give you guys a heads up that uh, I, me and my fiance are actually in the process of uh, moving into our new house, which means a lot of my time is going to be going into packing and moving and painting and all that. So I'm not going to be able to do a lot of like in-depth, heavily edited videos or animations uh, for a good few weeks or a month. But I do have stuff in the works. I'm working on animation right now. I'm going to do my best to put out uh, what I can for you guys. Uh, I'm doing a let's play of uh, Bug Fable right now, which uh, if you don't know what that is, it's basically a spiritual successor to uh, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. I'll be uploading that probably like every other day. Uh, it's just a little bit of something to put in there while I'm doing this home transition. So I, I highly recommend you guys check that out. Uh, I also have a Paper Mario uh, let's play. I even have a Mario RPG let's play. But don't worry, there's definitely a lot more stuff in the works if you uh, subscribe to the channel to watch my animations or my discussion videos. I might sprinkle a few in there. I want to do one talking about uh, what stages or what stage and music and whatnot I would give Sora if he were put in the Smash Bros. But yeah, so just uh, be patient with, uh, with me, guys. Uh, I'm so excited. I know the channel is still tiny right now, but... I mean, I've gotten over 100 new subscribers in just the past few days, and it is a great feeling. Thank you guys so much. Super helps out the channel. I'm trying to get this channel as big as I can so that I can just work on all this stuff full time. I can really just start going crazy with animations, making longer and more complex ones. I do uh, largely hand drawn, so obviously it's very, it's very time consuming. But uh, I'm I'm learning more as I go, and I want to try to create the best content possible for you guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video, and please stick around and watch uh, whatever, all my other videos. I'll link some cool ones in the little end card. But uh, yeah, until next time, it's been real, it's been fun, it's been real fun. Have a good one, guys.